Coach Kabala, how many finals did you coach in today here at the OAC? We had, uh, I was in six of them today. It was very privileged. It was awesome. Did you, wait, how did that line up? You were able to, you were on the mat every time then almost. I was. I, a couple times I had to run back and forth and I actually coached a couple of the side matches too for placement. So it was crazy. Uh, so you coached every, every match, every round then? Pretty much, yeah. Holy fun. smokes. I'm tired, but it was fun. It makes it worth it for sure. Where are you coaching now? Uh, I'm helping out up in Notre Dame. So, so no Notre I Dame? work at Notre Dame, and then I've been helping out Coach Romano and Sonny and Jake up there. Um, I guess a few of the volunteer assistant, but I put a lot of time into that, and then I'm still able to work with all the club kids, and I'm going to be helping out a lot with the freestyle and Greco this spring. So What club were you guys training out of, all these kids you're coaching? Uh, they, they train out of Notre Dame, and then I help out um, use Aurora's room and a couple other places, Brunswick, with the Fields Brothers and some other places. But I just go, and then they have a USA card, and we make sure everything's under wraps, you know what I mean? So it's good. It's fun. So you, I'll tell you what, man. You're hustling. You're all over the place. I'm everywhere, man. Like a visa, everywhere you want to be. <laughs> How much fun you having, man? I'm having a blast, man. It was great. All the travel's crazy. I was at D2s in Iowa last week with Notre Dame helping them coach. We were runner-up last week. Um, and then I've been back and forth with work with the NCAA D1s and then back and forth down here all weekend. So I've been hustling around, but it's a good time. I enjoy what I do. I have a, I have a lot of fun, and these kids are awesome, man. How tough is the OAC? I mean, it's incredible for the for the four divisions at the grade school, but the junior highs, the, you know, as, as Gus Sick, or Guy Sicko said, this is the crown jewel for a kid to win, right? Oh my gosh, it's unbelievable at this point. You know, there's only one division, obviously, and then the kids go up to three divisions in high school. I think it's a huge indicator, you know, where they could be down the road here. You know, uh, we were talking about it earlier today. Uh, I was talking to uh, J.O. about it. My bracket actually in 2002, I was a runner up here and there was 19 state champs eventually that came out of that in different divisions. Who beat you in the final? Sean Nemec. He's a stud. Are you serious? Yeah, I swear. Holy smokes, that's a loaded weight. So Nemec, myself, Macklemore, Piecraft, Linus, um, Christensen, who oh else? Oh my god, that was your bracket? Uh, Tice. Oh my gosh. Th um, Thorn, yeah. Was, That's crazy, man. It was man. crazy. And we're, you know, a bunch of us, multiple time state champs and stuff like that. It, it was awesome. Crazy bracket. You go back and look at that stuff. It's like, wow. <laughs> and you're a channel firebird. I was a channel firebird. <laughs> I love calling it channel, man. <laughs> Zay Peter Chanel, yep. All right. Not a school anymore. No, no, unfortunately. I know you guys get sad. When I bring that up, I get, like Anthony Ralph, I think, wants to smash my face. He gets pretty it's mad. All the time. He gets a little better, right? <laughs> Wait, yeah, it's tough, you know, but it, there's, a lot of, there's a lot of people, you know, a lot of us are still coaching. We're very highly involved in the sport. You know what I mean? You have Jaggers and Ralph at Ohio State. State. You have Hogabooms up at Lake Erie. He actually just retired, but he was there. Um, I'm helping out at Notre Dame. Cody. Cody. He's at Gardner Webb. Um, this goes on and on, man. I mean, it's, incredible. It, it's, it's awesome. I think it's great, you know. And then you have a bunch of these guys helping out with clubs and high schools around the area, giving back. And I think that's so important, you know, and to give back and that trickle effect down. I mean, it's, it's an awesome thing. So, Firebirds are alive and well in the sport, just unfortunately not at home base, if you will. So, that's good stuff. Next week, will we see you here for a uh, grade school? No, I, you know what? I can't trickle down that far. I'm too spread thin, but I think I'm probably going to head down to high school nationals before I jump into locking hand season with freestyle and those guys. So. The locking hands. Thank you very much. That's my new term for it. There you go. Hey, thanks for the time. Congratulations to you and you, and you guys uh, wrestling today. Thanks for everything you do, Zeb. Awesome. Thanks,